Uh, hello everybody, today in this video tutorial we would be learning how to insert a hyperlink on a frame maker in a frame maker document. Uh, it's very simple, but however it's not simple as Microsoft Word, but here are the uh, procedure you can follow. So this is a document uh, where we would be inserting hyperlink. Uh, a link can lead to a website or a link can lead to a uh, location within the document. So first we would try to link uh, within the document. So this is the uh, section where we would be inserting a hyperlink for m information about art captions and callouts click here so uh, first of all uh, this, uh, we would be going to the destination text where the link would lead to and uh, we do have a paragraph under art captions and ca callouts so we would select this uh, text go to the hypertext uh, pod and select the option specify named destination and then uh, under the syntax box we would add the add a given name to the link you can leave it as uh, art caption and callouts and uh, once we add, enter the na link name we would copy it and because we need to paste this to a specific place which I would let you know so once you're done once you select it and copy it click on new hypertext marker and now we would go to the place where I would insert the link that's at the top of the document. Uh, here it comes. Uh, so you can click, you can select the text where you would insert the link, and select the option, a specific uh, jump to name destination. So we would paste the link name or the name destination, and select new hypertext mark marker. So now here we can see the link is inserted. Now to test the link, we would. Uh, click make view only and s click s click on click here so once we do that we can you can see now we are in the destination uh, text so it's very simple now we would uh, learn how to hyperlink insert a hyperlink uh, which would lead to a web website so this is the text uh, for more information click adobe.com just select this uh, particular text and uh, copy the text go to the option go to URL under the hypertext pod and paste the link you can paste the entire URL and click on new hypertext marker so once again you can click on make view only to check the link click on it and here it comes Okay, uh, now we would be uh, learning how to insert a cross-reference on a frame maker document. Uh, cross-reference points are very important when you try to navigate uh, in a long, doc large document. Uh, it's like a navigation tool, uh, like hyperlinks. So you can cross-reference a header, heading. You can cross-reference a section or a body. Uh, so in this case, we would be learning how to uh, cross use a heading as a cross reference point um, to go to cross to insert a cross reference click on special click on uh, cross reference you get a cross reference pod now you can see uh, all the paragraph tags listed which you can use at a cross reference here we would be using heading 2 so under heading 2 you would be able to see all the uh, text which are tagged as heading 2 now we would s select the last one dialog box syntax and you can also uh, f uh, change the format uh, how your cross reference would look or appear on the page I would leave it as it is uh, as of for now click on then you can click on insert when you click on insert you can see a cross reference link dialog box and text so if you click on it it will lead to that particular section so uh, in order to test it click on make view only and uh, click on the cross reference link and here it comes so thank you for watching the vi uh, video.